In numerology, 22 is a master number with a high vibration. It's a powerful manifestation number and encourages us to keep moving forwards with our dreams in mind to achieve our goals. Seeing the number two everywhere signifies positive changes and opportunities that are coming. The more twos there are, the better the changes and the bigger the opportunities. It also encourages us to believe in ourselves, listen to our hearts and trust we're on the right path as we all have a divine purpose for being here. Two is the balance of the yin-yang, the masculine and feminine energy in complete harmony and peace. It's love and togetherness embracing each other, since two is company, T for two and two for T, and a tandem bike being a bicycle made for two. When playing bingo here in the UK, the number 22 is called as two little ducks and encourages the response of quack quack from those playing. When everything is aligning for us, it can be described as getting our ducks all in a row. The flower of life is a symbol in sacred geometry, which consists of 22 interlocking circles representing the connection of all life forms. The book Catch 22 by Joseph Heller describes rules and regulations that must be followed and heeded to. If you need something, it must be seen that you don't need it in order for you to get it with those in control that have created the situation, trying to hide and justify their abuse of power. The number two tells us to focus on ourselves and on our spiritual well-being, as it has significant spiritual connotations. In the Bible, in the book of Luke, 22 verse 2 and 22 verse 22, they both refer to the conspiracy against Christ. The Last Supper is described in chapter 22, where Jesus knows the name of the person who betrays him, but he chooses to remain silent and not reveal them. The strength he shows in doing this inspires us all to follow him and do the same when confronted with unfair and difficult circumstances. We will have our rewards for being true to ourselves and for listening and following our hearts. Other notable number two verses in the Bible are Genesis 2 verse 22, where God takes a rib from man to make woman. The chapter then continues to explain that they are both of the same flesh and intended for each other as equals. In Samuel 2 22 verse 2, David spoke unto the Lord, declaring him to be my rock, my fortress and my deliverer. There are 22 generations between King David and Jesus. The last book of the Bible, Revelation, has 22 chapters and the Hebrew alphabet has 22 letters. There is no such thing as coincidence. It's all part of a divine plan of God's great plan.